Well, hey guys, uh, welcome back. Uh, back with uh, another video here. Finally getting around to doing more of these after, you know, not being able to do any for like a week. But uh, I'm finally able to do a, a good video. The last, you know, the last video I did, you know, kind of you know, had some, you know, basically talked about what had happened the last week. But uh, this one, this one is a good video. And uh, I hope you guys will enjoy it. I think I, I know I know I will because it's been a while since I've been able to do one of these. But uh, before I get into it, uh, again, if you are new to the channel, uh, welcome. I hope uh, hopefully you enjoy the videos. And uh, if you do, don't be afraid to hit uh, hit like and subscribe. If you've been here before and you just you haven't quite gotten around to hitting that subscribe button. Go ahead and do it if you, you know, go ahead and do it if you want to, because you never know. You might, you know, if you're if you're having a if you're having a crappy day, and uh, you know you happen to you know see one of my videos pop up in your feed, you go and you go and you watch it, and you know maybe it makes you feel better. If it if it does, hit that subscribe button. I'm I I I'm glad to help out any way I can. If somebody's having a bad day, if one of my videos can cheer people up, awesome. So, and of course, I have, uh, you know, I, I want to see by the end of the year if I can get, how close I can get to a thousand subscribers. And uh, for new people and people who haven't quite hit it, who haven't quite uh, done it yet that have been here before, hit that subscribe button. It, uh, like I said, might, might make your day feel better. And a video like this hopefully would too. So, this video... I have this. This is one. This is one of two. I have another one back here that uh, I plan to uh, that I plan on unboxing. I'll, I'll do that one in, or unbagging, unboxing, unbagging, whichever term you want to use. I plan on doing that in another video. But this one, this one was sent to me. As I go into my desk drawer, I'm going to retrieve that. This was sent to me by, uh, it was a, a guy on uh, one of the uh, hockey jersey groups that, uh, that I'm on on Facebook. And he, sell, he sells a lot of, you know, a lot of, you know, cool looking, you know, cool looking stuff. And, uh, and he's over in Sweden. And uh, his name is... Uh, I, I got this from uh, Leif, I think, you know, if I'm, you know, hopefully I'm not butchering, butchering your name completely. Leif Bjorling? I think that's how, I think that's how that's pronounced. Leif, when you watch that, when you watch this, if I completely butchered your name, I apologize. Let me know. But uh, I got this jersey from him. And the crazy thing is, this, which came from Sweden, the one that I, the other one that I have back here, came from Canada. They arrived the same day, which I thought was kind of cool. So, and this is this is an interesting, this is an interesting jersey because it's it's a it's a jersey that I plan on you know I that I I, I want to you know kind of do a little comparison also with. Uh, you know some of the you know some of the other jerseys that I have, and just you know be able to tell the difference. So let us get into this. As I've only been I've only been waiting to do this for like a week plus. And let's see here. Let's see. I gotta be care. I gotta be careful here where I with. Gotta be careful with this. I don't want to. I do not want to cut too deep into this. Oh, let's see. I can get it open here. All right. Come on. All right. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's see what this looks like. Come on. I can get this out of here. Get out of there. Okay. 
Okay, it comes in. It came in a bag, that's for sure. Oh, wow. Ooh, okay. Ooh. That's an that's kind of an interesting material. That's really cool. Very similar very similar bag too to uh what the uh what the NHL or the uh, Adidas uses when they uh, when they bag their stuff. Now again, this is this is the one that's not an NH this is not an NHL jersey. I wanted I, I wanted this one mainly because I I kind of I kind of like the way the logo was and the color of the jersey. But I also kind of a cautionary tale in a way. But uh you'll see why here in a in a second. So, being it's a it's a it's a non-NHL jersey. Let me know what you get. Let me know your guys' guesses. What do you think it is? Do you think it's from another uh hockey league? Do you think it's you know from a different site completely? Let me know what your guys' guesses are. So, if you guys are wanting to guess, you can gladly hit the pause button on the video. Let me know your guesses in the comments. That'd be absolutely awesome. And uh yeah, so I'll give you a little little time to do that. A little, uh, little slight pause as the dog as the dog is scratching at the door. Okay, so this might be one you guys probably would have a hard time guessing, but uh, I think uh, I think you guys will find it interesting and. Uh, any last second guesses? Check this out. Now, now another thing, another thing too, is I got this, you know, to see how the size is too. So check this out. This is this is the, the they're from the uh, the Swedish Hockey League, the SHL, the uh, the Rogel team. Rogel BK, I think. I think that's who it is. Now, Leif sells a lot of these. He's got a bunch of different, uh, different leagues. He's got like, he's got like Brinus. He's got uh, HV seventy one. He's got, he's got a lot of cool, a lot of cool uh, uh, European league jerseys, but. I just I've always kind of looked I've always kind of liked the logo because the logo looks a lot like the Edmonton Oilers. Now where do I get into this? Okay, there we go. Oh, I did that a little different. I did that a little differently. I normally unbag it first before pulling it out or before showing everybody. Oh wow, that's an interesting that's an interesting feel. It's a very interesting feel. Let's see how big it is. Now, of course, here is this is okay. This is okay. This is made. This is made, this is made by Bauer. This thing. Wow, this thing's this thing looks huge. Look at this. Look at this thing. Now, here is the cautionary tale. The European leagues, this is what they have all over their jerseys. They, as you, as you can see, there's ads everywhere. Even on, even on the back. This, this is what us jersey collectors of the NHL are afraid of that this could be the future of the NHL jerseys as you can tell here they got even on the even on the show on the uh, on the sleeve I think it's on I think they got the same ad on both yeah they got they got the same ad on both sleeves of course down there it's just you know and this is and this is all and this too these are not di these are not different fabrics either. This is all this is all sublimated into it's all sublimated into the jersey. And uh, 
And yeah, it's definitely a different feel from the Adidas. Now I am curious, and of course, yep, there's the there's the tag. Yep, official product of the SHL and Rogel. Now, the SHL, now the European leagues are interesting, depending on where you finish. You're not guaranteed to always be in that league from one year to the next. Because if you play bad enough where you finish at the bottom, it is possible to get relegated down to the the second tier league. The SHL, of course, is the top tier league. So, so yeah, this is definitely an this is definitely interesting, and it, and and the fact that it is it's all sublimated. So this is how they do this is how they do the jerseys over in Europe. They sublimate everything, except of course, the logo is actually the logo is actually sewn on. So let me try this on. What size is this? This is a yeah, this is a two. This is a two XL. This apparent. This is a two XL. Over in Sweden. So, let's see how this thing fits. As I said, I've never, I've never bought. This is the first European League jersey I've ever bought. So let's see how this fits. Because now each one has a different feel. <sighs> The sleeves are nice. The sleeves, the sleeves fit nice. It's a little snug in the body, a little snug in the body, but not not too not not terrible. It's not ter not really terrible at all. And I do like the logo. I think the logo sits a little. I think you know the and this is the thing with with European leagues, with all this all over them, the logo gets pushed down. Some of them, the logo is like way at the bottom, and the rest of the jersey is all ads. But uh, so, I mean, the logo is not bad. You know, I like. I definitely don't mind the uh, definitely don't mind the logo. But again, the cautionary the the cautionary tale here is with the NHL starting with ads. How long is it going to be before it looks like this? Where you're gonna have ads on the sleeves, you're gonna have ads on the front, you're gonna have ads on the neckline, the shoulders, even by even even behind the back, and of course, down at the bottom. You know, at what at what point does the you know is the line drawn there? But uh, but yeah, this is a this is an interest to this you know. Besides, besides the ads, the, the feel of the jersey is interesting. This is a very, you know, it's a it's a definite interesting material. I will, uh, I'll give you guys a closer closer view here. Let's give you, let's go and show this here. Of course, here, this is, like I said, this is all sublimated. That's all. It's all sublimation sublimation print. And of course, you know, you got all that, you got all that there. But I try to get in a close up of the material. As you can see, that's all sub that's all sublimated into the jersey. Definitely kind of cool. Now let's show the logo. Here is the logo. The logo's all it's all nicely embroidered and everything. It's not it's not sublimated on. And again, this has this looks very similar to the Edmonton Oilers. I love the color. I think I think the green, the green is really really nice. The you know the design here is is fantastic on both sides, and of course you know you got the bird with the crown. I just I th I think that's that's tremendous, and of course as you can see here it it is sewn on, but 
it's an interesting, it's definitely an interesting material. And, uh, yeah. So, I mean, not, not, not too bad overall. You know, not, not too bad overall. And of course, like I said, this is, this is, this was made by Bauer. And again, this is the cautionary tale of what does the NHL look like in five years? Do they look like this? I mean, these are all, I mean, these are all different companies that they do, that they, that they work with. And, you know, I mean, obviously they're Swedish, they're, a lot of these are Swedish, so, you know, we're not going to understand exactly what all of the words are, but I mean, but I mean, even on the, even on the neckline here, you've got ads here and here, it just, you know, that's, that's what, that's what makes me, that's what makes me afraid of if the NHL does that. I really, and I really hope they don't. For jersey, for jersey collectors like me, I hope they don't. But one of the reasons why I got this, I didn't have a European League jersey, and I had, I had always kind of wanted one anyway to see, you know, exactly how the fit would be and, you know, stuff like that. But, uh, but I did like the logo. I thought, I thought the logo looked cool and I, I do, I do like the color. I like the color scheme. I like how they did that. And, uh, and yeah, overall, besides all the ads, it's actually a pretty, pretty nice looking Jersey. I definitely don't mind it with the exception of the ads, but, uh, let me know what you guys think. You guys like it? You know, I mean, the the jersey mainly, not necessarily the ads. But, uh, you know, let me let me know what you guys think. Do you guys have the same fear that I do? That within the next five years, you might get the NHL team logo, get moved all the way down, and the rest of it becomes this? And back here... You know, I mean, that's that's kind of my fear that that's going to end up looking like that. But uh, let me know what you guys think. And uh, again, uh, thanks to a uh, uh, big thank you to Leif for uh, for sending this to me. It is a it is a very cool. It's a very different. Uh, it's a different feel from the Adidas and uh, the CCM for sure. And uh, yeah, it's. You know, it's still, it's pretty, I mean, it's pretty decent quality material. But yeah, I mean, like I, like I said, as I showed, it's all sublimated. The only thing that is embroidered or sewn on is the logo. Everything else is sublimated into the jersey. And, uh, and yeah, so let me know what you guys think. Do you guys have the same fear that I do that within the next five years, the NHL could look like, could look like all of this with, Ads here, ads all over the front, the back, the shoulders. You know, let me let me know what you guys think. And again, a big thank you to Leif for uh, for sending this. I have my first international international jersey, and again, this is from the uh, the SHL, the Swedish Hockey League. And uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, I will also leave a uh, I'll leave a. Uh, a description or a, a description a link to the discord and uh i think there's a there's a there's a link there was a link too that uh that i think life sent me that i'll probably include here because he he has all kinds of different uh european league jerseys i think he's got i think he's got jerseys from for almost all the leagues over there so again let me know what you guys think and uh Again, you know, if you've if you've been here before or you're new, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, it'd be awesome if you uh, if you hit that like button. If you really love the stuff, hit that hit that subscribe button. It would be absolutely greatly appreciated. Like I said, I'm trying to see how close I can get to a, how close to a thousand subscribers I can get by the end of the year, and I would really appreciate uh, your guys' help with that. And uh, and yeah, so my first international jersey. And, uh, yeah, let me know, let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you think of the, uh, the walking, the billboard here, basically. 
And uh, I'll see you guys later.